And God said, Behold, I have given you every herb bearing seed, which is upon the face of all the earth, and every tree in the which is the fruit of a tree yielding seed. To you it shall be for meat. Yeah, no, God says he created it. The human being is the crown of his creation. Right, okay. Yeah, we're to, we're to um, subdue everything, you know. Everything is kind of under our control. So, I guess, oh, yeah. dominion. I mean, like, dominion. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. that's the word. Do you yeah. think dominion we have over children, too, like? Well, no, you're not allowed to kill children, no. No, no, no but no, do you no. think dominion means automatically to kill and slaughter and... Uh, no, no, dominion means to, to, to subdue protect the land, and, and subdue the land, take like, care so, of, like, like with trees down and grow a crop, you know, like, like um, do like it, take do, care, like be the guardians and like, take care it. of. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, take care of the of the planet. That's it. Of his, of his creation. Yeah. Do you know we kill 150 billion animals every year? Yeah, yeah. That's it. Slaughter them, torture we'll, them, we'll, put them we'll, in slaughterhouses. We do have to eat, but that's. Yeah, do you think we could eat a, a, a an option like a yeah. fruit or a vegetable? I think the body, well, the body needs protein. You get, get protein at a certain. What range, if you can get What if you get protein from a plant source that doesn't you don't have to have a slaughterhouse or a gas chamber. Yeah, no, I see what you're saying, but I... Do you, I like, with God, right, because yeah. I believe in a creator too. Yeah, yeah. And do you think that he would think that slaughterhouses are uh, okay? He, Jesus was God in the flesh, right? And he did eat meat, you know, all the time. The fi so. He's talking about the fish? He didn't eat pig. He ate fish. Yeah, he do you ate think fish. Jesus would, would, would agree with the you slaughterhouse? Okay with you okay with fish? No, no, no. Any animal product. No, 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 yep. no. Fish feel pain and they suffer. They want to live and, like, they, they escape pain. They, they don't want a fish hook in the mouth. They suffocate. Yeah, well, nervous system. And that's it, yeah, yeah. So in our, in our hearts, like we see the animal suffering and we, we think yeah. like, why would we put an animal through suffering when we can choose bread or yeah. fruit? Yeah, I see, you, you, you're pushing something here, but I, you don't understand this, but I, I'm looking more at eternal matters, you know? I'm more worried about where our spirit ends up, you know? We right. have a spirit. Wow. Yeah. We're gonna go well, to meet So you believe the same thing, essentially, I, right? I, me yeah, too. So you probably are on yeah. the same I, I believe in the creator too. I don't, I, don't, I don't think a big bang, I think big bangs are uh, a joke. So have a look at us, you know? We, we exploded from... Say, yeah. It's all but, put together, but, isn't it? It's all put together. Yeah. I honestly don't think that an all-loving God would think that slaughterhouses are a place of... Yeah, well, he does say thou shalt not kill, but that is relating to murder. That's not taken up... But who told life. you that? Well, because because God in the flesh, you know, Jesus, who died for us, yeah. he ate meat. Now, if God was against eating meat, he wouldn't have ate meat, you know. But That's you know, he, in, in, the the of Eden, in the Garden yeah, of Eden, it's God it's gave us plant-bearing seed. He had a calf when his um, prodigal son came home. They killed the calf. What about the... Feast, you know, you're so. familiar with that, the, the, the seed-bearing plant in the Garden of Eden? God gave us seed-bearing oh, plant yeah, yeah, that did, shall yeah. be our meat. Yeah, yeah, everything, yeah, true. In the, before sin entered the world, everything was laid on. Okay. That's true, yeah. So, yeah. so why should we continue sinning? Why not go back to the Garden of Eden? Oh, I can't answer everything. If he doesn't, no, 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 no. Down, I can't tell what, you. What yeah. does he, no, what, no, 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 what yeah. does your heart say? He gave you the God-given gift of wrong and right. What does your heart say? About animal, about eating about animals. About why don't we eat plants that he gave us too and that don't suffer? What, what would your heart say? What would God... Well, our guts your... kind of made eat both, isn't it? Like it'll, eat, it'll handle... You know, okay, if, you, plant, if yeah. you look at that and yeah. your conscience says that's not good, what's God telling you. Yeah, I don't have a problem with eating. I don't, I don't eat pig. I don't. I don't. I think pigs are a dirty animal anyhow. That's what, like they kind of got it. I'm a farmer by trade. I know yeah. a fair bit about animals, but pigs don't um, sweat. Like they yeah. keep all their toxins in. So if you eat bacon, you're getting all the crap. Yeah, yeah. All the thing that the body couldn't get rid of. So yeah. like well, pigs eat everything. Like you throw a dead sheep into pigs. They'll eat every. If you want to get rid of the mouth, you want to get rid yeah. of someone. They feed it to the pigs, you know. Oh yeah. Because there's like nothing left. Yeah. A lot. Yeah. 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 But, yeah. We're not talking about it from our point. We're talking about yeah. from the victim's perspective. Yeah, no, I don't, like, like from a, said friend, the I, pig doesn't yeah, want to be eaten. I don't like killing animals either. You know, I don't like. Why not? Animals. If it, we're meant to eat them, if God said eat animals, they yeah. sh he shouldn't have made them so they suffer and so that we feel weird about it. Exactly. Yeah. Why would He do that? He's yeah, not an idiot, man. So like, just, you know? Yeah, I know. He's very, he's certain, very. But, but when he, but when he himself is eating meat, I believe that endorses it. You know, so that's. But, but he calls the seed-bearing plant meat as well. In the garden, yeah, yeah. So that, that is the thing you can't answer, right? No, like I you, can't. You don't that, really have a. No, I don't have an answer. Yeah. See, I'm not going to. I'm not going to act like an old because God knows everything I don't. But know? that's but, why he gave you the gift of knowing wrong and knowing right, so yeah, you can right. navigate yourself through True. these issues. Yeah. But God won't contradict himself if God in the flesh ate fish and ate meat, which Jesus did. Feed the feed the. There was something called fishweed bread. back in those days. Fishweed. Yeah. yeah right, it was yeah. seaweed. Bread and fishweed. I've heard yeah. that too. Yeah, yeah. That that there has been translation issues with the Bible. But remember, he fed five thousand people with the fishweed and, and bread. The little boy brought the fish and the loaves along, and he fed the lot, fed everybody. You know, so, so I think supernaturally multiplied it. You know, God does that. So yeah, yeah. So from your perspective, right? Yeah. Do you yeah. think that God would would be okay with slaughterhouses in destroying a planet? destroying well, his he, creations. Put it, let me put it to you this way, you know, the world is busy at the moment redefining right and wrong. I just yelled it out there a minute yeah. ago, but you know, abortion is a far bigger problem than this, killing people, you know. 
How it's many, like how many a babies get aborted each year? How many animals are getting killed oh, every well, second? Yeah, but how much more precious is a person too? Like the, the crown in, of God's creation. Well, God said He gave man a spirit, but He didn't say He didn't give the animals a spirit. But he all of His that, creations. I'm not, I'm not debating just because He says that. That's all. Yeah, yeah. But all of His creations would be dear to His heart. I mean, why would He create animals that suffer? if we're meant to kill them and eat them. Well, you know, as you said about the garden, see, the original intention of God was for no, no one to suffer. You know? That was the original intention, but then sin entered the world, and that's where suffering came from. You know? We should go back to the garden where there was no sin. That's, that and we can do idea. that in our lives now. In the Christian tradition, what we have is a Jesus who is the Prince of Peace. And it's important to remember where that comes from. It comes from the prophet Isaiah. And the Prince of Peace in Isaiah 11 is ushering in God's new age of nonviolence. If we read Isaiah 11, the holy mountain is filled with the knowledge of the Lord, where even the lion lies down with the lamb, and there is no bloodshed whatsoever. Yeah, oh, we can't because we're in a sin, we're in a fallen body. The world isn't. Well, we can do our best. We can. Yeah. You do believe we can do our best? Like yeah, if we don't have it. to eat cruelty and suffering well, and violence. I, what, what, what I would recommend to you, and what, what happened to me 20 years ago, get a relationship with God, and then He guides I you. I have been know. developing my relationship yeah, yeah. with God. Have you been born? And He's been giving me strength to come back to Him broken and screamed out to Him, you know, because that's what He does. It's not church. I used to go to church, and He saved me, took me straight out of church. Because church is a lie. Hey, so do you eat animals? Son? I, I, I'm a farmer by trade. Yeah, I raise animals. So Oh, because it tastes nice? <laughs> yeah, no, that's shallow answer. No, no, that is. You know, I was talking to a religious guy last week, and he said the same thing. He said, if, I said, there's a there's a lamb in the middle of the room, Jesus on one side, the devil on the other. There's a dagger in your hand. I said, who's telling you to kill the lamb? Other instances are Christ's condemnation of animal sacrifice at the temple in Jerusalem. Yeah, I'm not that no, no, no. The de example, why not? There's there's always good and evil. There's the devil and there's, there's God. Spiritual forces. Who's that's telling true. you to kill the lamb? Yeah. Well, Jesus. No, no, no. no. Who saying, do you think's yeah. telling you to kill the lamb? Uh, the lamb is like neither here nor there in, in my eyes. Like I, I don't. So you, yeah. what do you care about in terms of living beings? Do you care about humans? I care about people's eternal destiny because so we are eternal. Care, yeah. so you don't care about animals? Oh, yeah, I do. So like, but I care more about the babies that are being murdered. I care more about that. Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So you just That's care right. about you. Only care about humans. Well, I, I care about what God. God gives me the guidelines here. He ate fish. He ate meat. What, what about dogs? Thou shalt not move, oh, thou shalt here's a good one. What about dogs? Did you kill a dog? Have you got pets? I have shot, I have shot a dog before. I didn't like it. No, I had no, to. It didn't feel good. No, but the dog's attacking the sheep. Yeah. Then so you, you had, had to. You, know, you did what? To, yeah. Well, to that's not murder. To stop the cruelty to the sheep, you know. So. <laughs> so, <laughs> but then you go and eat the sheep. Oh, no. So what is that? You're going against your yeah, natural but, instinct. But they're ripping the throats out, you know. But when we... when when Look at that, dude. Yeah, Come guess, on, bro. Probably, there is, that is not God is, loving. I know, but there is. I mean, that, but is that God's work? Oh no, well, God said don't eat pig anyway, so, that, so that that's is, not it. But do you think that? Do you, you eat pigs? No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, no. But do you think you can still believe in the word of God and be, be a Christian, yeah. but still straight, like it, make your own decisions? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. So you yeah. don't have this to is, do This is not a salvation issue as such, you know. Like, okay. It's just like an, it's a conscience thing before God, I believe. Like, wow. When he said don't kill, he said don't kill other humans. Yeah. He ate fish, he ate meat, but I do believe in humanely killing. I treat my animals as humanely as I can. When I'm raising God, but we were discussing that before. It's, it's not right. really a human life. Quickly. Yeah, yeah, that doesn't basically. want to die. Yeah, it well, doesn't you, really want to die. We no, were saying that before. But do you kill your own animal? I mean, okay, let's take it to the extreme as an ant, then I tread on it, you know. Oh, did you, oh, did you do it on purpose, though? Yeah, we don't yeah, believe probably if they're gonna We probably me, do that, too. But you're going to go you, up your pants. Okay, but yeah, so, if you're so defending you, yourself, if you're we, defending... Where do you draw the line between, you know, well, salt and a fly well, and... Well, well if you're under attack... You wouldn't, no, but what if they were... If you're under attack, then you can defend yourself. That's what we're saying. What if the flies were that thick in your house that it was unhealthy for your children? But are the chickens... Oh yeah, I'm just trying to. But are the being facetious? I'm trying to say there is a time that we need to yeah, kill yeah. something, you know. But not like yeah. not like this. No, yeah. no. But when I spot a fly, I don't pluck one wing off and then the other. No. I just go. That's yeah, like, mate. there's no yeah, need yeah, for yeah, that. Yeah. Like, no, there's no need for that. I agree with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna leave it with Joey. Please, mate. mate. All the best. Nice to talk to you. Yeah, you too. Yeah. Joey, Joey knows that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Cheers, Joey. Yeah. I'll get him back to the boys anyway. No worries. Yeah. But yeah, he gave us conscience. He did. Wrong or right? And if he, if you look at that and that goes, that's not good. Then who's? I think. I think that he's talking to us telling I've us. I've seen farmers, you know, starve. Like the killing them to me is kind of, that's quick and they're going to die anyway, you know, we all are, but that's quick and clean, but somebody who starves an animal, you know, or doesn't let it have a drink of water, that's worse. You know, that, all that these animals suffering. are treated yeah. unfairly. Like farmers can be cruel as well as meat works, you know what I mean? Farmers send all their animals to the same slaughterhouse. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Is this Australian footage or overseas? This is Australian footage. Yeah, is this TFI or who are these?
these people? Uh, which which slaughterhouse do you know? This is Australia wide. Some okay, are in yeah. Adelaide here. Some yeah, of the piggeries right. are here in Austra yeah, South yeah. Australia. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's it. There's no loophole around whether it's going to be humane or not. I just don't think. Yeah. If you can't, you can't. This is your passion, and this yeah, this kind of matters. But in eternity, our de our eternal destiny is so much bigger deal. You know, heaven, hell. We're playing for keeps there. Yeah, maybe this is something to do with it. Maybe this is this means well, something. By being good, you don't get there. It's just by being forgiven. But once you become his child, he guides you in that right doesn't give us That you. doesn't give us the right to go out and just slaughter. No, it, no, it doesn't. No, no, no. That's it. You know what I mean? Well, There's still you mean, wrong yeah. and well, right. There's well, I agree. You know, morality. There's... Call, me, call me whatever, but I can't kill my own sheep and eat them. You know? Yeah, because I can't it's, it's not straight. natural. Yeah. God didn't it. make us like yeah, that. Yeah, I don't like that. No, that's You pick an apple, you eat it, it's sweet, it's tasty, you want it. You haven't killed anything. Yeah, but if you put children in this slaughterhouse and say, watch this, they're not going to want to eat it. And God created these children. You do have a point. There's a point there. Yes, yeah, there is a point. I'll, I'll God created us like that. Yeah, yeah with, a, with, a, with a conscience and that, that makes awkward. us sick. Yeah. Why would that make us sick if it was natural? And, and he also gave us a conscience for this reason. I just preached about so that we know we fall short of his standard. Yeah. And then we come back to him. That's what, that's what repentance is. Salvation is not church attendance, not the sinner's prayer. It's just coming back to God broken. Like, people won't do it. They just they get, get all religious, you know? It's not it. I think religion's given God a bad name. It has. If you look at it the devil, worldwide. The devil runs religion. He does. There's a tip for you. He runs out too, mate. Yeah, yeah. He runs out too. Peter makes the argument that Jesus, like many religious leaders throughout history, was an advocate of kindness and mercy, and that this outlook was in no way meant to be limited exclusively to human beings. Brass tacks, though. Even if Jesus wasn't a vegetarian, Christians have to ask ourselves, what does it mean? that animals are treated as so many inanimate objects today. What does it mean that chickens are given less space per bird to live their lives than an eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper? That they're crammed by the tens of thousands into these sheds, cooped in their own feces. That their beaks are seared off without any kind of anesthetics, seared off with a hot iron, so that many of them starve to death because eating becomes so painful. That they're crammed under the back of these transport trucks by the thousands off to the slaughterhouse they go, through whatever weather extremes, many of them dying, and they're hung upside down, and that they have no legal protection whatsoever. Now again, if we did this to dogs or cats, Christians would be horrified. If a kid hurts an animal, their parents will say, that's not nice, stop that. Even that's not Christian. We all understand that it's unchristian to hurt an animal. But we suspend reality when we sit down to eat, and we want some chicken nuggets. You know, and it's killing us, and it's destroying the environment, and it's patently immoral, whatever your faith background. The notion that Jesus was a vegetarian may set an example not only for Christians, but for anyone who sees him or herself as a kind and merciful person. Leonardo da Vinci said, I have no doubt that one day all human beings will look back on this murder of animals in the same way we presently look at the murder of human beings. So it's inevitable, and the question is, what can we do to make it come about more quickly?